Ready for more bad infectious diseases news? There's an outbreak of bird flu making its way into you. As poultry flocks. If the virus continues to spread, it could affect poultry prices, already higher amid widespread inflation. The price of chicken breasts this week averaged $3.63 per pound at you. As supermarkets, up from $3.01 a week earlier in $2.42 at this time last year, the Agriculture Department says. This week an outbreak was confirmed at a commercial flock in Nebraska, causing 570,000 broiler chickens to be destroyed. In Delaware and Maryland, more than 2 million birds at commercial poultry flocks have been affected. In South Dakota, an outbreak last week led to the killing of 85,000 birds. An outbreak confirmed March 14th at a commercial operation in Wisconsin meant more than two. 7 million egg-laying chickens were killed. The latest data from the USDA show 59 confirmed sites of avian flu across commercial and backyard flocks in 17 states since the start of the year. That figure includes chickens, turkey and other poultry. The USDA identified a case of avian flu in a wild bird in mid-January, the first detection of the virus in wild birds in the U.S. since 2016. Wild birds can spread the virus to commercial and backyard flocks. By February 9, the virus had been identified in a commercial flock in Indiana. There have since been hundreds of confirmed cases of wild birds infected with avian flu. The last major avian flu outbreak in the U.S. was from December 2014 to June 2015, when more than 50 million chickens and turkeys either died from highly pathogenic avian influenza. HPAI, or were destroyed to stop its spread. During that outbreak, chicken breast prices increased 17%, according to agriculture data company Grow Intelligence. But at the same time, prices for cuts of chicken gear toward the export market actually dropped due to bans on importing U.S. poultry in countries including China, South Korea, Cuba, and Mexico. So the cost of leg quarters, for instance, dropped 18%, according to the data. Poultry prices, especially for eggs and turkey, were affected for years, the company reports. Whether the 2022 avian flu will affect the price of eggs and poultry depends on how widespread it becomes, says Ron Keen, a poultry science expert at the University of Wisconsin-Madison Department of Animal and Dairy Sciences. In 2015, we did see quite an increase in egg prices, Keen told Wisconsin's. The chicken meat wasn't severely affected at that time. We did see quite a loss in turkeys, so turkey prices went up. So, we'll see. If a lot of farms contract this, then we could see some real increases in price. What's the risk to humans from this bird flu? Not much so far, says the Centers for Disease Control and Prevention. According to the CDC's most recent update on March 7, the H5N1 bird flu poses a low risk to the public, and is currently primarily an animal health issue, 